Hey guys, and welcome back to more Resident Evil 4. Now, I am really pissed off, unfortunately, because we cannot go back and get the treasure. Um, oh, I'm so annoyed at myself. Cannot go back and get these treasures. Um, sadly, where we fought Salazar. But, you know, we'll save that for our new game plus run that we're inevitably going to do. So, unfortunately, it is what it is. Damn it. Looking for something? Always, Ada. I can't. Oh, that's the chapter end as well. Yeah. Literally cannot believe we can't go back. Um, unfortunately, there isn't really an obvious um, bit <laughs> at the castle where you can't go back. Um, bit unfortunate, really. But, you know, it is what it is. This is a blind run after all. So, I mean, I'm going to be playing this game multiple times, so it is what it is. Anyway, onwards! You look like you've got something to say. I have something to ask you. But I don't think I'll get a straight answer. Raccoon City. You know, after the incident, the world changed. You try to save one person, a hundred others die. I guess I changed too. <laughs> you? Leon S. Kennedy. You haven't changed. You just think you have. There it is. So here's my question. Have you changed, Ada? Or are you just trying to use me again? What do you think? We're here. Don't think too hard, handsome. <laughs> See you later. Don't think too hard, handsome. And off she goes. Like a petal in the wind. So here we are, chapter 13. Oh. Yeah, I'm so annoyed that we can't go back and get that treasure. But, you know. It is what it is, I suppose. Kind of way more annoyed about that than I think I probably should be. But, whatever. Right. Ooh. Ah, oh, look at this. Look. Oh. Right. Well. Let's go to work. At least as much as we can. Wow, look at this place. I mean, it's kind of just like old times. Kind of. I don't know why we can't just use the mouse wheel to, like, zoom in. You know, like every other game. But, whatever, I guess. So, let's explore. It looks like we've got some sort of like laser defenses. That's new. Oh. Hi. Oh, there's no water to jump over. It's just kind of like straight in. Okay. I guess if we walk in the way of that, it's kind of. Oh. 
kind of like instant death. Hey, mer ooh, merchant. I've got some new eyes. Welcome. I what have you? you? Stocking up while you You've can. Got the killer. Excellent. Sixty-four thousand to upgrade. Oh God, that's expensive. It's got gold tokens. There's some things money can't buy. Yeah. Oh shit, we can't afford that either. Oh, that's that's unfortunate. Will that be all, then? Maybe. Well, we'll hold. Oh, we've got to sell the cubic device, even though we didn't but use it. Well Lip rouge. <laughs> Thank you. Ah, uh, ah, oh, god, damn it! Oh, my back is killing me. Yeah, you're a you bitch. Kind to us, I you're an absolute knob, mate. Because. Honestly. Good luck to you, stranger. Well, thank you, but oh, God damn it! Ruby's Sound like four of these. No difference. The price, well, that's our they deal really well give you a lot of cash, it. though, do they? This kind of work is about finesse. That's about all I can do for this weapon. Although, no, never mind. <laughs> no, never mind. Yeah, maybe we'll hold on to the. Welcome. We'll hold on to the key. I guess for now. <laughs> Suit yourself, stranger. We'll be back. Don't you worry about it. Now, oh. Expelled by the military, militant wicked, we find ourselves in exile. Weathered is the grass, barren are the trees. We wait in expedition, this isolated island, our purgatory. Yet despair not, brothers and sisters, our time shall come. Hester Sadler. Now, on that note, I did find... Um, caretaker's note. Or oh, wait a minute. Castle. Don't remember finding that. Effects and uses of specific drugs on the plugger during early stages of growth. Facility one, mining room S. Presenter, Head of Research, Annabel Garcia Escaludorado. Questioner, Researcher Chen, uh, Ryan Chen. And that's all for today's report. Any questions? So basically, this suppressant can prevent the host from turning into a monster. Laughter. Monster is a bit dramatic. But yes, you could say the host loses part of their humanity when infected with the parasite. Initial symptoms include mild abdominal pain and uh, hem hemptotysis, followed by dizziness and even loss of consciousness. Once fully developed, the parasite gains complete control. In other words, the host becomes a puppet. The supplements we've developed can inhibit the growth of the parasite, so it can only delay the inevitable, right? Like having one more beer before going home. <laughs> <laughs> well, yes, when you put it that way, but sooner or later, the bar closes. The suppressant can't completely remove the last plugger from the host. Okay, didn't see that one. Ah, so I actually found this one when I was trying to go back to the castle. I have failed you, my lord. I was unable to fulfill your final commandments and keep the boy from the path of wickedness. 
I caught a glimpse of Master Ramon's evil temperament during his younger years, when he discovered a servant mocked him by uttering Paul Garcio behind his back. He summoned her to his private chambers. After forcing her to kneel before him, Ramon doused her face with a vial of vitriol he pulled out of his pocket. The young master watched with glee when the servant writhed in agony as the skin melted from her face. His twisted grin still haunts my dreams to this very day. No oh, fuck. As time passed, Ramon's treachery only deepened, and that infernal cult soon learned they could prey upon his vulnerable heart. Curse the fiends. They've manipulated Master Ramon and turned him into their puppet. Worst of all, they've managed to use him to unleash Las Plaga and the Salazar fam uh, that the Salazar family has fought so long and hard to keep sealed away. Lord Diego, rest assured, I intend to watch after Master Ramon until the very end, whatever fate may fall us. As a faithful servant of the Salazar family, since birth, it is my duty and my penance to you. So, the Salazar family was not always evil. They were actually guarding the Plaga. Which is interesting. Um... Okay. Oh, wait, we can just, like, turn it off? Right. So, that doesn't turn it off. It just changes its direction. Curious. Very curious. Okay. So, what have we got here, then? I guess the shit's going to hit the fan in a minute. We still don't have enough to get the village map. I wish the village map was paid for in cash. Oh, I guess we don't have to move any beams or anything. We've just got to move, like, laser trip mines. Okay, those guys are significantly stronger. As I guess we should have realized. Oh. Hello. Can we go up and knife this guy in the back? Oh, here he is. Up and down, up and down. Well, that solved his problem. Right, so laser trip mines. Now, I guess laser, well, laser trip hazards are probably bad. Probably. I'm hoping we can find some more. Spinals. Otherwise, we're in for some chop. And that's putting it lightly. Where is this guy? I can hear someone. Ooh. It's got to be up here, surely. Evening. Good evening, sir. There we go. That'll make you feel better. Alright, so, somehow, guess we can't get in there, somehow, okay, well that's easy enough. I guess we're not going to worry about treasure too much now. 
Oh. That'll do. There we go. Oh, hello. That's bad. Oh, hi guys. Let's get up here. Nice defendable position. Evening lads, uh, ladies, everybody in between. Ooh. Oh, he, oh, okay. That'll do. Oh, he's got a hat. Don't want you wearing a hat, sir. Any more for any more? Ah, shit. He's mutating. Okay. Don't mind that. Is that it? Nope. Well, I'm just going to burn him alive. Probably the best thing that could happen to him. So, no, like, minigun man? I guess. At least not yet, anyway. Ha! Huh. Oh, I can hear some more. Yep, here we go. He's dumped. Who is making all that noise? Who is making all that noise, honestly? Oh, hi. Let's get ready. Oh, hello. He set himself on fire. Uh oh. No, no, no. No, no, no. Definitely don't want any of that. We good? I think we're good. Okay. Okay, we're good. Good evening. Here we go. Looks like we do have the guys that have got the stun rods. That's going to be problematic. And we're out of bullets. Luckily, we can make some more. Quite a lot more, apparently. That's fine. Right, come on, Leon. Yeah, those things are actually reasonably tough. I say reasonably. So no guy with a minigun. Interesting. Okay. Oh, hello. Definitely so oh hi. I knew it. Definitely surprised about that. Did think we were gonna have minigun guys. But Guess not. We have the rest of the guys though, the guys with the metal hats on. As if that's going to save them. Dicks. Desperately needed those bullets. Okay. Right, well there's nothing back through there. Let's keep advancing. Oh. Hello. We sneak up on this dickhead and knife him. Alright, that was surprisingly easy. 
Good night, sweet prince. Wow, look at this place. It's way bigger. And more interesting than in the original. Ooh. There is... A nice little explosive. Right. Let's keep our sneak on for now. Oh, hello. Hello. Good night, my friend. Looked like he was about to take a piss. This looks similar to the OG. Good to know. So, uh, there's a yellow herb still there. If we shoot that... guess that does not raise eyebrows. Golden Lynx. Was that a Golden Lynx in the original? I got a feeling it... I think it was. Oh! Ah, uh, hello. Well... That's not good. That's not good at all. Yep, thank you. That's bad. So those shields actually do protect them. I don't know if they're invincible, but they're tough. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Nope, 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 nope. No muty time on my watch. So they've got frickin' unbreakable shields now. Hello. I see somebody with a rocket launcher. Somebody had a rocket launcher. Not on my watch, pal. Definitely starting to strain our ooh, hello. Strain our ammo a little bit more. Oh! <laughs> he just like fell off. Good. Couldn't have happened to a nicer chap. And we're on average we're finding more cash too. Hello, dickhead. Come to daddy. You're done. Seriously? Oi, you lot. Oh, hello. Come on. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Ow. Dude, honestly. Uh oh. Son of a bitch. Yeah. That's not good. But can we lure him this way? I wonder. Let's see if we can't drop this on his head. And how much effect it actually has. How much effect if the host is on fire? Uh, not that much, apparently. I don't know. Possibly slightly effective. Possibly. Okay, let's have a look up there. Could have been better, Mr. Twister. Oh, we've got some cash. 
and some more coin. Ah, we're finally on. It's just a bit of rain. Stop being a bitch. Now. Ooh. I was going to say, is there a merchant still here? Guess not. Wonder if we can still use the crane. If there even is a crane in this one. Guess we'll find out. Oh. See if we can run up to this dude. There we go. That'll do. That'll do we. Let's get rid of you as quick as we can. Definitely don't want you letting loose one of them RPGs. There we go. He's done. Oh, that hurts. That's fine. Really? Oh. Say that's actually unfortunate. We need one more. One more. Ow, dude, honestly. Have some of that. Whilst I just blow myself into oblivion. Yeah, that's what I thought. That sorted their problem. Definitely could have been better though. And I can hear. Aha! Thought I could hear an emerald. Ah, oh, we didn't get the bloody emerald either. Um. Not the emerald. We didn't get the crow's nest. Oh, another elegant clown. Probably make that worth some serious cash. <clears throat> Where is that? He's over here somewhere. Where are you? Over here. Oh, that's going to irritate the shit out of me. Where are you? We can hear it. Like, definitely loud. It's definitely coming from this side. Come on. Could literally be anywhere. This side. Ah, there you are. Must have looked at it. Okay, so we've got another crown, which is nice. So we can at least get like maybe a hundred grand. Maybe a bit more. Depending. Doesn't look like I can get in through here. Need to find another way. Well, that's not good. Um, okay. Oh, I'm so annoyed about that key. So annoyed. You no, you have no idea how irritated I am over that. Ah, uh, right. One for you. One for you. One for you. Mm, it's only worth 81. That's unfortunate. <sighs> OK. 
can we make it worth at least a hundred? No. It's worth 81 if we use the lower grade gems as well. Alright. We use the lower grade ones. Alright, well, whatever. Um, so, how do we get in there then? Back up this way, I guess. Almost, almost Krauser, almost. We don't have those big guys with the axes either, but we've got a lot of explosives. Anyway guys, I'm going to end it there. We are literally out of time once again. So I will catch you guys in the next video. Thank you very much for watching.